Hey folks, Ben here once again with another gear demo on the YouTubes housed within the InterGoogle. Yeah, let's go with that. <laughs> what are we looking at? We are looking at the Dumbleweed, I have notes, the Dumbleweed Overdrive from Outlaw Effects. Thank you Outlaw Effects, they provided the pedal, just so you know. And uh, we're gonna check it out. I am playing, as usual, my Mexican telly. Why? Because we can coil tap the humbuckers so we can find out how this pedal sounds with both single coils and humbuckers without Ben swapping out guitars and editing video. I know, yeah. So, we've got uh, four controls and a button. Of course, it runs off a power adapter because there's no room inside for a battery really cool little layout we have we have the manual a little light on the documentation but we have the on off switch obviously we've got the LED indicator we have the gain control which handles the amount of overdrive imagine that level which is your overall volume you have a voice where right in the middle uh, voice controls the color of the overdrive, turning counterclockwise to darken tone, turning clockwise to brighten tone. So it's, it's like a mid contour, like a tone, but it's not a tone. Why? Because there is a tone as well, which controls the brightness of your overdrive tone. Turn counterclockwise for bassier, smoother tone, turn clockwise for a brighter, more trebly sound. All right. Oh, can you believe that just hit me in the head? Oh, wow. Who knew? Full contact demos. So uh, I've got this in humbucker mode right now. Clean tone on the bridge pickup. Single coil bridge. I'm gonna give that just a little boost on the old volume. And I am playing through my B52 AT112, 60 watts of goodness. Uh, with a little bit of reverb on there because you gotta have reverb. You gotta have reverb. So, uh, everything's at 12. put it over to single coil now on the neck pickup and I'm just going to go through neck middle and bridge and single neck middle and bridge humbucker just a few quick chords and then we'll start uh fiddling with the dials and see what we can come up with varieties there okay so we know the guitar is doing its trick can this thing do this trick I'll probably just stay on the bridge and the humbucker position going forward because yeah it's all good with intentions of using different pickup configurations but so put the gain all the way down you lose signal so we'll put the gain at about nine o'clock Thirty-two o'clock. Maxed out. Not too bad. So I'm gonna put the gain at about what? We at one o'clock. Start playing with that voice.
Noise is now at 3 o'clock, Blast is at 9 o'clock. Maxed out. That's basically at noon. I won't bother messing with the level because, well, here, we'll do it for a sec. does what it's supposed to do. So we got the tone down to about nine o'clock. Three o'clock. Of course maxed out. Voice down and tone all the way up. Both all the way up. Well, there's your ice picker tone. Woo! Let's leave the voice up and the tone down. First impressions off the top of my head. Voice and tone seem very similar. You know, especially when you have one maxed and one uh, minimized. Yeah, that's it. Mm -hmm. um, very similar sound. So, what does that mean for you? I don't know. Fiddle with them. Find something you like. That's what I would do. So yeah, um, not too shabby. Retail on these, can't remember, but I don't know if I've seen an outlaw effect that costs much more than a hundred bucks Canadian. Uh, made in China, uh, distributed out of Montreal, at least in Canada. Available at both of my channel's borders. Arden's Music, our preferred Canadian retailer, and Flipside Music, our preferred American retailer, which, oh, look at this. Pull back the curtains and we're wearing a Flipside shirt. Totally by happenstance, folks. But uh, yeah, you know, cool little Dumble-esque, we'll call it, you know, the Dumble weed. I really dig it with uh, the gain at about two o'clock and... So it is uh, rather mid-focused, uh, which is cool. Um, actually, I like running a fuzz pedal into it. It's a lot of fuzzes, you know, are very mid-scoop sounding, very uh, fizzy almost. You run it into this, even with the gain at about 10 o'clock, and it brings back more of those mids. And uh, yeah, it's actually uh, rekindled my love for fuzzes is this pedal right here. So there we have it. We've got the pickup turned off. Let's put the guitar down. Let's grab some cables and we'll give you at least a close up of this guy. There we are, folks. Check it out. Do a search online Outlaw FX Dumble Weed Overdrive. Till uh, next time, I am Ben. If you're new, please subscribe. I believe it'll be right down about there. Uh, it could be a subscription thing floating around up here, too. Check it out. If you're returning, thanks as always. New or old, please leave a thumbs up. Leave in the comments down below what you think of the Dumbleweed. Maybe, or type in, how about, I'm dumb for Dumbleweed. <laughs> there we go. Till next time, I'm Ben. Cheers, and hold those doors open.